So I decided to change my club, the Champagne Steam Rooms, into an elegant cocktail bar. The Champagne Steam Bar. Obviously, it still needs a bit of work, a little paint, you know. Um, but, you know, it's vintage. Kids love vintage. All the cool kids love vintage. You know, it's partisan, it's organic, it's pop-up, it's you know, hot desking. It's... Okay, that's Abdi. You lot remember him, obviously, yeah? And this is Tia. Well, She's running the cocktail bar. bar. So, hey, Titi. Sorry about that. One pinatini for the boss, please. Pronto. No, sorry, I can't hear you. Repeat that. Dear. Okay, so the champagne with Laurent Perry. Oh. Dear. What? Um, no phone calls at work, please. What are you talking about? I'm placing an order. Good, well, get back to work then. Champagne is the best cocktail yeah. bar in um, the Hounslow area, no, definitely the Hounslow West area, without a doubt, without a shout of a doubt. It's the kind of place you take a girl, you know, to show her that you're not afraid of the finer things in life and you can give them to her, yeah? Here we go, ladies night, yeah? It's ladies night and I feel all right. Ladies night, two for one drinks, that's every night. Why is it every night? Because ladies, I'm trying to, you know, ladies are welcome every night, it's ladies night. I'm a feminist. So we got the cocktail menu here. I'll talk you through some of the, uh, you know, champagne surprise, yeah? Little surprise in there, not in a date rapey way. My classic, peanut teeny. Very, very high alcohol content. Uh, mystery cocktail. This is something I like to just throw all kinds of shit in it. It's got yogurt, it's got cumin, vodka, rum, absinthe. Yeah, just throw it all in there. Mystery cocktail. Sex on the beach or at the bar. We can have sex right now. <laughs> Let's have sex. My idea of a good night out is basically, you know, loads of cocktails, loads of banter, and loads of sex. That's a real lad's night out. Did you get that a lot? Not, I mean, that's what, um, that's what I created the cocktail bar. So I've had the cocktail bar, I've got the banter, <laughs> Chabanta G, you know what I mean, AKA. Um, still waiting on the sex. What we're gonna do today for you guys, this is like a cooking show. Let's make them the mystery cocktail because I haven't actually talked you through that. Okay, first of all, people, you know, people like to use French mint leaves, you know. I think, what's the point when you've got, you know, mints here? So, get a few mints. Strawberries, you know, normally people crush them up. I like to get the organic pulp of them, so we just... And that just goes straight in there like that. Okay. And a bit of brandy. Get the lime. We just want the pulp out of it, so just grab the pulp out of it. And in it goes. In there as well. Um, obviously, peanuts. People would normally use the pineapple, but what I really like is just the spikes of the pineapple, just uh, the garnish. This is really what makes the, uh, the mystery cocktail. Just a bit of avocado, a bit of guacamole. Throw that in there like that, and then obviously give it a good shake. Yeah. Here we go. <clears throat> and here we go. One mystery cocktail on the house. Oh, fuck. Cheers.